All right, someone wants to come out of the cold and offer someone a commitment. This is awesome. All right. So let me just quickly have a look. The overall energy is the king of pentacles. All right, that's earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Can you guys see the cards? I'm sorry about the setting, guys. I'm going to change it soon. But yeah, someone wants to offer stability, security, commitment, marriage. This is someone who is very, very stable, very genuine, very reliable, all right? You could have earth in your birth chart or you could be dealing with someone who has an earth chart. What happened in the past? All right, so someone was single, all right? Someone being single happened. <laughs> so probably someone either got out of a relationship or someone just was just single focusing on their work focusing on their money focusing on themselves um looking nice going to the gym smelling good doing all that good stuff what's in the current situation we have the wheel of fortune in reverse okay things not really going your way or there are negative changes that are impacting your life and forcing you to push you out of your comfort zone why is all this happening because we have someone stubborn as fuck we have the emperor here could be dealing with someone who has Aries in their birth chart or you could have Aries in your chart. Someone's very stubborn. They want it my way or the highway. What's on your mind, Gemini? You don't have the three of cups. You want a reconciliation. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You want to reunite. You want to meet someone. You want to chill. This is definitely a reconciliation. Why is all this happening? Is because the charity is reversed. Could be dealing with a fixed sign cancer. Something's not moving forward or something's just come to a complete halt, all right? You could be wanting to travel towards someone, but yeah, something's come to a halt. What you'll be experiencing in the near future is the judgment, okay? You're going to give something a second chance, okay? This is a rebirth. This is reconciling. So what's on your mind and what's going to happen in the future? I guess that's happening. Anyways, let's clarify. Clarify for the King of Pentacles, please. Why is the King of Pentacles as the overall energy for Gemini? Yeah, you want commitment with someone. King of Pentacles, clarified by the Ten of Pentacles. You want commitment with someone. Clarify for the Ten of Pentacles, please. Clarify for the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, so probably after a period of a break, maybe you're not in communication with this person. Okay, we have the Four of Swords. So, <clears throat> Gemini, your overall energy, you want to offer a commitment, you want to offer marriage, you want to offer stability to someone who, this is also another way of looking at it, you want to offer this to someone who's already married, could be, okay, I have a strong feeling this is a little, uh, marital energy, you want to offer this to someone who's already married after taking a time out, okay, after you, you clocked out for a while, you couldn't have been in communication with this person, after taking a time out, after gathering your thoughts, taking a break, I think that's when now you've thought of going and offering commitment to this person. Why is the Nine of Pentacles in the past? Why is this Nine of Pentacles in the past? Yeah, someone went single. Someone, we had clarified by the Knight of Cups in reverse. So someone was single and independent and they were on their own, okay? And uh, this is someone who could have revoked the love or offer, okay? Someone could have been emotionally manipulative or someone was just shut down completely. Clarify by the Knight of Cups in reverse. Strong chances you're dealing with a water sign. All right. Yes, that's it. Right, Gemini? Why do I have a very strong feeling this is you everywhere who's blocking everything? So in the past, you have the Nine of Pentacles with the Knight of Cups in reverse and the Emperor. So someone was single and they shut down completely. Why? Because they didn't have things their way. This is someone very, very stubborn, very, very strong. Okay. Someone very... Um, like I said, right? Repeating myself again. But yes, my way or the have you. Okay. They want it like this. Or it's not like that. This is just how it's supposed to be. Very stubborn. Very possessive. Uh, this is someone who could have loved the other person very much. Maybe if this is you, Gemini, you could have loved the opposite person very much. But this is someone who doesn't really show their feelings, okay? This is a boss. This is a businessman. Why is the Wheel of Fortune in reverse as the current situation for Gemini? Yeah. Uh, things didn't go your way. Things came to a complete halt. Could be dealing again with a water sign. This could be someone very matured. Could be someone married. But this person loves you very, very much. So things probably didn't go very well with a water sign who loves you very much. But probably they're not showing it. They're not very expressive about their love. Clap for the King of Cups, please. And they were trying to avoid you or you were trying to avoid them. We have the current situation as the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, King of Cups and the Seven of Swords. Someone could have tried to self-sabotage this relationship or this is someone who was trying to avoid the situation or even try and strategize. I think so. Things didn't go your way. 
but this is some with a person with a with a water sign doesn't have to be with someone who really really loved you but they but they're not expressing their emotions and they're trying to avoid the situation i need one more card why is the seven of swords here why is the seven of swords here? i need one more card why is the seven of swords here yeah <clears throat> someone tried to get away someone was trying to ignore the situation why because they're reflecting on the past we have the seven of pentacles here someone's reflecting on the past they're trying to see if they should invest in this thing or not or they're just trying to wait. This is more like a waiting thing, right? Like, am I going to get the fruits of my labor? See, in the overall energy, I see someone backed out, right? Someone took off their time. So this is what someone took their time off. They could have been trying to, instead of working on this, I think someone just tried to back out in a very sneaky way, right? They just like cut off the connection, could be. And, um, but there are two people who really, really love each other, but they're just shut down emotionally. So yeah, the kind of situation someone's waiting after avoiding, ignoring the situation. They're not avoiding, ignoring the situation because they have someone else in mind just to put that out there. They're just trying to reflect on the situation. Like, should I, should I, should have, could have, would have kind of, you know, like that kind of energy. More like waiting. They're waiting to see if things are going to happen their way or not. Clarify for the emperor. Who is this stubborn emperor? Why is the emperor here? Yep, this emperor could have... One more clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Oh my God. All right. So we have the Emperor with the Queen of Wands in reverse and the High Priestess in reverse. Right, give me a minute. Someone's been super stubborn about the way they want things. And that is why it could have been the Queen of Wands in reverse. I mean, this is where someone lost their passion. Someone lost their vibe, the go for it vibe, okay? Why? Could have been because something was revealed. Let me put this out there, okay? The High Priestess in reverse, usually people think it's like something's been revealed. According to me, this is someone who's had half truth. This is someone who's got half the truth, half the information, and they're interpreting the entire situation on uh, that half truth or, or. This is just for a few of you. Someone has got some clarity, but which is not really the clarity. It's just half the truth. Like, like I said, half truth is always also a lie. And this is someone who's interpreted the information that they have received or whatever has been revealed according to their own egoic dependencies. Okay, so whatever suits their ego, they've taken that information. Why? Because the high priestess is in reverse. Someone's not trusting their intuition. They're going against their intuition and believing something that is not true. Just to put it out there. All right, why is the three of cups here on Gemini's mind? Why is the three of cups here on Gemini's mind? Yeah, you're manifesting this reconciliation, baby. Clap for the magician. It's also clap for the magician, right? A magician is also Aries or Gemini. You have this very strong Aries of fiery energy, okay? Clap for the magician, please. Right. So, what's on your mind, Gemini? We have the Three of Cups. We have the Magician. And we have the Eight of Cups in reverse. You. You want a reconciliation. You want to meet this person. You want to give this a second chance. You're manifesting this re this reconciliation. Why? Because you cannot walk away. You cannot walk away, Gemini. If this is not you, this is not the person. I see a lot of water here. I could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right. <clears throat> and why is all this happening? We have the chariot in reverse. Why is the chariot in reverse? All right. Clarify by the ten of wands in reverse. Why is the ten of wands in reverse? What was the situation that was laid out? Clarify the ten of wands in reverse. Hmm. Really? Do the, 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 you know, you know, I'm go I'll, I'll tell you what I'm going to tag this as. Okay, so why all this is happening? Why this entire thing is going down is because things are not moving forward. Something came to a complete halt. Someone put on the brakes in the middle of the fucking road. Why? Something was very burdening. Something was stressing someone out. The relationship was a big burden. Someone laid off the situation, okay? They laid down the burdens. And now, guess what? Now they want to come to you at snail pace with a stable, committed offer. One thing I can assure you for sure is that commitment is coming, Gemini. Either you're giving this to someone or someone's coming to you. It's coming on a tortoise. It's coming. This is a very well thought out offer. All right. You know what? I think so. I think this break was needed. Seriously, Gemini. I think this break was needed. Things had to come to a halt. Whatever was burning. You've completed the cycle with this person. Okay. 
because it's like the 10 of wands in reverse i mean like you've completely laid off the situation that was really overburdening you know what like fuck it i can't do this anymore and now after a break you've thought this out you've meditated you've got your shit together and now someone's coming towards you with this offer or you're going towards them with an offer clap for the judgment why will gemini experience the judgment in the future clap for the judgment please ha 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 clap for the hermit clap for the hermit why is the hermit here why is the hermit here right so gemini in the near future you're going to experience a rebirth a reconciliation you're going to give something a second chance after going into the hermit mode which is going into withdrawing right i see a lot of withdrawal here you're not in communication with this person i i 100% you're not in communication with this person this is someone who's withdrawn pulled back okay doing a lot of introspection what they need to do next and what's happening and again again you or the other person or both of you are manifesting this we have the three of wands someone's waiting someone's manifesting any one more card clap with the three of wands clap with the three of wands please yeah whoever's manifesting this is emotionally very very shut down or is going through a very is very very sad okay someone's manifesting a new beginning but they're very emotionally shut down they're hurt this is a lot of sadness but i think the the, the reconciliation is coming after someone has withdrawn from you or there could have been someone who is still withdrawn but they're manifesting this right they're manifesting someone's very hurt someone's hurt in the past also someone was single someone probably could have got out of a relationship all this is happening because of the emperor the emperor is very very determined and very um stubborn like i said right however i think this all is happening it's a good thing because the things didn't move forward the halt was needed the burdens were supposed to be released and that's when someone realizes that uh, i should have made the offer or this could have also been that because the, the, the thing didn't go forward because someone let go of this burden the offer could have been coming in but it was too slow and the opposite person was like you know what like fuck it this isn't happening however you're manifesting this new uh, reconciliation this relationship they're manifesting this relationship it's going to be after a period of break you both are going to get in yeah i think you guys are going to get back together for sure gemini try and analyze the information whatever has been revealed try and analyze it one more time is it a co- have you have you analyzed the information according to what you think is correct because you blocked your intuition for sure all right gemini i hope you enjoyed this reading thank you so much for watching this video please like share subscribe comment and i'll see you next time bye bye